It's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for whenever it resonates. <laughs> you know, the timing is fluid, so, you know, it is what it is. Whenever it resonates is, is, is when it is. So, this reading may or may not be for you. It may be, or it may not be, or it may be for you in a couple days, or whatever. What do we have for a message today? What do we have for a message today? Profound change, some of something like that, because what I just saw was the death card. And so, you know, the death death is a profound change. It's a renewal. It's a transition. It's a new beginning. A new beginning to follow after an ending. So there is some sort of release, a release that uh, that leads to a new beginning. Um, things are about to change, and they're going to change in a really, really big way. Now I see the Nine of Cups, which is things looking up being deeply satisfied with this change so somebody is going to be very happy with this change um king of pentacles reverse now the overall energies of king of pentacles reverses instability here insecurity we could have somebody that is uh poor this person is poor they're lazy they're spendy they make poor financial decisions uh losing stability somebody that does things illegally so somebody could be you know gambling <laughs> misuse of money misuse of finance finances somebody could be losing a job i hate to start out a reading like that but the king of pentacles in reverse this is somebody who is selfish as well selfish and greedy egotistical temperance is going to be some sort of change or an exchange okay could be an exchange we have somebody here that um is going to be going through a change put it that way okay now temperance comes after the death card in the in the tarot deck so there's some sort of ending that 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 uh causes a profound change now this is about blending blending compromising perhaps somebody may need to compromise this is a card of purpose everything everything happens for a reason yeah purpose and reason so we have this person over here this is a person okay this is a person that is going to be experiencing i mean it's a it's a loss with the king of pentacles and reversed a loss Hmm. two of pentacles <laughs> right underneath it so we do have somebody that is, is definite loss financial loss financial loss there's a financial imbalance somebody has made some seriously poor financial decisions here they've made some poor decisions they didn't have any contingency plan. Now there's a financial mess. There's could be you now there's imbalance. Somebody didn't balance their books effectively or something like that. There's definitely a lack of balance. Somebody's feeling a little overwhelmed with their poor decisions. But this is about allowing and accepting change blending to create harmony learning a lesson so we do have somebody here that is learning a lesson they may be losing something because death is an ending okay remember i saw that death card at the beginning so they're losing something is ending because of their poor financial decisions because of their poor decisions period some this person may have even been takes made some risky business deals you know they may have done something really risky Everything is supposed to be done in moderation because this is a card of moderation. Happiness, okay, so happiness. This is uh, getting better. Something is about to get better. Somebody's made some poor decisions. It is going to get better. It is. We have a new beginning that is about to happen. Okay, this is a new beginning. A rebirth or a renewal of some sort this is being accepted this is 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 something is about to get better hmm. 
four of wands. Fantastic. So we have some somebody here that has been through a struggle, obviously. This person has been through a struggle, but things are about to change. And they're going to change for the better. They are going to change for the better. But they are. They really are. So this is a big, bright opportunity that is coming. So Somebody must have learned their lesson. Somebody has learned a lesson. They have. Because they've been struggling. Things are about to get better. Now this is a commitment. It's about committing. Committing. Big time commitment. Hmm. Now this is also a gathering. Somebody could be going to a gathering or going to a get together. They're setting up. They're getting ready. These people are setting up. They're setting up the the uh, get together. There is, and, and I don't know if this is a dance or what it is. It's a dance or a party of some sort. But anyway, happiness is coming. <laughs> okay. This is happiness. It's going to be good. This is going to be great. It is going to be great. It's going to be fun. Seven of Pentacles reversed. Now this is dissatisfied. Hmm. Nine of, there's a Nine of Cups. There's going to be drinking, partying, something. Somebody is going to some sort of get-together. Um, or they're going to some sort of party. They're going to some sort of party. They're going someplace where there's there may be some sort of celebration. There's an upcoming celebration here. There is. The Seven of Pentacles. There's there's this is lack of investment or of investment there's no no growth here something is coming back around something is coming back around somebody could meet somebody unexpectedly at some sort of celebration and this may have to do with uh, seven years and seven years old Maybe you knew this person. There's some sort of, it could be even a reunion of some sort. Some sort of reunion or party or gathering or get together. This is this, whenever I see this card, I always think of seven years. I don't know why it always makes me think seven years. Something about seven years. Maybe it wasn't realistic. Something wasn't realistic. Somebody wasn't being realistic or something wasn't the right time. Because this is about time. This is about time. Two of Swords. Seven of Cups. Beware of false beginnings. There's a, this is a card of consequences right here. And we got nine of cups here. Somebody needs to open their eyes. They're wearing a mask. They're not seeing something clearly. Somebody is not seeing an opportunity. They're not. They're not seeing an opportunity. Somebody is not seeing an opportunity. They haven't seen an opportunity. Somebody's been blocking their emotions or just choosing not to see, protecting themselves. We have the moons in here, so something is something is being shown. Something is is coming about that you have. Somebody is coming around that you have not seen in a long time. Maybe at that time it was unrealistic. Something was unrealistic about that. But so this now it's now it's time. It's time. <sighs> Whatever. Seven of Cups. Now the Seven of Cups is a card of thinking you got to think about this it's a choice somebody's making a choice it's like they have multiple options looks like they got their eye on something 
There's an opportunity for wish fulfillment. There's a definite opportunity for happiness here. We have happiness, happiness, happiness. So there's an opportunity for happiness, but you got to choose wisely. There's a choice between two. There's two very prominent options here. So we have somebody here that is thinking about choosing. They've been unable to choose, perhaps. They've been un they haven't been seeing it something, but now they're seeing something. Like something is happening. Something now they got to make they need to make a choice. Somebody's making a choice. This is a choice. This is a choice. So choose wisely. Choose wisely. So somebody is in the process of making a choice as to what is going to make them happy. This is definitely about happiness. So happiness is coming. It is coming. But you have to, it's your choice. There's a card of consequences here. We have somebody here that obviously has suffered some sort of consequences because of their poor choices. It's like they're being given another chance. It is. It's like they're being given another chance. They're given a, being given a chance for, for happiness now. But you got to make sure that you are making the right choices. Make sure that you are investing properly. Make sure that you are giving it your all because this is an opportunity to have it all. So somebody has an opportunity to have it all, but they're going to have to put in their all to have it all. So, you know, you can't, you can't block your emotions. You can't be in denial. You have to own up to things. You have to open yourself up to change. So I think we have somebody here that it, it, you know, is starting or they're going to be opening themselves up. Um, there's a definitely an opportunity for happiness here. Somebody may even be getting proposed to. They don't even see it coming. They don't even see it coming. It, it could be a surprise. It definitely could be a surprise. Somebody is, is going to meet somebody um, that they haven't seen in a long time or they're going to have a reunion with somebody that they haven't seen in, in years. And this is years. This isn't like six months ago or two years ago. This is years ago. So I think there's something, there's some sort of uh, coming together with somebody that you haven't seen in years. You know, that's what I feel like this is. I feel like uh, there's going to be an exchange of some sort and it's going to make somebody very, very, very happy. Um, it's time. It's time for happiness. It's, it's time for this reunion. So there is some sort of reunion here. Five of Swords. Five of Swords is betrayal. It is betrayal. It is... Uh, whew, it's a hostile situation. Um, huh. Five of Pentacles reversed. Ooh. Unhealthy relationship. Somebody abandoned somebody in the past. There's been some sort of an abandonment here. It's like somebody got pushed away. Somebody pushed somebody away. Or they ghosted somebody or they left somebody behind. Now there's some sort of renewal or reunion. I don't know what the hell is going on here. But it looks to me like we have some sort of reunion. Um, somebody has been hurt. They've been hurt and they've been abandoned. They've been hurt and they've been abandoned. We may have this this person up here that is 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 this guy has made some poor decisions. Somebody has made a very poor decision, and maybe they've been experiencing some sort of financial loss or something. Total financial ruin here. Financial ruin. I seriously. We have somebody here that has experienced financial ruin because of their behavior, because of their bad behavior. Okay. This is bad behavior for sure. I don't know if we have a criminal here or what. It could be criminal behavior. Anyhow, but this is this is this is a get together of some sort. A reunion. Now there's light at the end of the tunnel. There's something, there's some sort of light at the end of the tunnel here. This is the, and I feel like this is the end though. It's the end of this betrayal. It's the end of this hostile situation. I feel like it is. I feel like somebody is healing from a, from a painful situation. Okay. Cause this is healing. 
Somebody's seeing the light as well. They're seeing the light. And it's time to celebrate. It's time for happiness. Somebody has been blocking their emotions, not investing. Now they're making a choice. They're starting to see something more clearly. There's an opportunity for happiness, extreme happiness here. Opportunity to have it all. But somebody has been hurt. They were pushed away. We have somebody here that had no morals. They had no morals. They had no conscience. They didn't care who they hurt. It's like they left They left somebody, uh, you know, maybe it was a woman and a child, a woman and children or whatever. Somebody was, was left. They were left behind. This part, we have somebody here that has been thinking, definitely thinking. They've been thinking, they've been thinking, 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 thinking about happiness, thinking about wish fulfillment, thinking about what they want, thinking about the future, thinking about everything that has happened. So this person has been thinking. They've been thinking about relocating. They maybe they realized that some they were being unrealistic. They've been dissatisfied. And they're looking f to be satisfied. So there's somebody is really unhappy with the choices that they have made, and they're thinking about making another choice. Maybe they're thinking about reuniting with somebody, you know, that made them happy before, you know, something like that. Um, the high priestess reversed. Now, the high priestess reversed is uh, somebody who chooses to be alone. The, see, the, the high priestess is also secrets being revealed. Something is about to be revealed. Somebody has been hiding their truth. They've been hiding their true feelings. They've been ignoring their intuition. They've been ignoring it. Okay, we have somebody here that has been, isn't very spiritual, hasn't been awake, but I feel like they're awakening up. They're waking up. Somebody has been hurt very badly. I don't know if it's this high priestess or who it is. It's, it's anybody. It's anybody. Somebody has been hurt to the point where, you know, look at this person. This person's ready to fight. So we have somebody here that uh, has been hurt. And it's like now they're maybe they're retaliating or they did retaliate or something like that. And now there's an opportunity to heal this, this relationship or heal something. Um, the high priestess reversed is, is, a, is a secret that is about to be revealed. It's been hidden, but, in, but it's going to be, it's going to come out. Okay. The secret is going to come out. The secret of the betrayal. Somebody has, and I don't know if there's been some, some criminal behavior and it's going to be revealed. Okay. Something is about to come out. Okay. There's been some sort of neglect or there's been some sort of betrayal. There's been some sort of crime. Uh, there's all crime. You define crime however you want. There's been some sort of crime and it's been hidden, but it's coming out. So I don't know what the crime is, but, um, this, there is, there's some sort of behavior that is about to be exposed by the looks of things. But anyway, um, now there's some sort of, uh, of, uh, uh disgraced, feeling disgraced. So I'm wondering if somebody is feeling disgraced. I think we have somebody that is choosing, they're choosing something else. After they've been blocking their emotions and they've been hiding their feelings and they haven't been following their intuition. Now they're starting to see something, another opportunity for happiness. And I think they're choosing another option. After blocking their own truth, they've been blocking their own truth. They've been in an unrealistic situation. They've been dissatisfied in that situation. And they're probably thinking, because of all the thinking going on, about a reunion with somebody else that made them very happy. This person made that made some very poor decisions, probably to engage with somebody that wasn't a good fit. So I feel as though there's going to be an exchange. Somebody has, has, uh, this is a card of evolved. They've changed. They've changed. They've evolved. They've changed. Their poor decisions has changed them. Okay. It has changed them. And now, 
uh, it looks as though they are, um, I don't know, they're ready to cooperate or they're ready to put in effort or to prove themselves. So they're ready to work together. This is proving yourself. Communicate. Some maybe some sort of communication is coming going to come through. Oh, oh! I just cut into the tower. Yep, I did. So this is this is a tower moment, a realization, the light being shed on a situation. Somebody has probably experienced a life change, or an accident, or a life changing event that has woken them up. Something has happened. There, maybe it was an accident. Okay, light is about to be shed on, a, or it has been shed on a situation, a false sense of security, a false foundation. So somebody is is or has experienced a breakdown, and maybe it's a nervous breakdown, or it's an emotional breakdown, or it's a mental breakdown, or you know something is falling apart or has fallen apart that was false. And now, you know, it gives them the opportunity to start with a clean slate because this is once this once once the tower falls, you know, the only opportunity you have is to start over. So somebody is going to be starting with a clean slate. Um, I feel as though we have somebody here that is choosing a new path. And I think this they they get this. Uh, probably a rude awakening, okay, with that tower and the cards that I see. They get this rude awakening that changes them and makes them see the light about where their happiness lies. And they uh, decide to unblock because this is unblock, okay, this is usually these are crossed. They decide to unblock their emotions and... Um, speak up perhaps because this is a secret being revealed one more card strength reversed strength reversed is lack of confidence low self-esteem feeling inadequate we have somebody here that feels like they won't be accepted they feel inadequate. This person may be very controlling and lacks respect for others. Maybe they're shy. Maybe they, they feel like they're they 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 don't they're not brave. We have somebody here that is maybe they were a coward. There's some sort of cowardly behavior here. Ego ego so we have somebody here that uh and this is a card of heart so somebody didn't follow their heart because and their ego got in the way they weren't listening to their intuition they probably have experienced some what goes around comes with some sort of karma this is this is unable to master emotions as well there's fear there's some sort of fear here. We have somebody here that is afraid. They are afraid of commitment? Marriage? So anyway, um... I feel in the next couple of days or whenever this resonates for you, we have somebody here that has made a poor decision, a very poor decision in the past. And they have experienced some sort of huge financial loss or something like that. And, and karma works in mysterious ways that has changed them. Somebody, somebody is, is going to, uh, some, this person has now changed. Somebody has changed. And it's like now they see the light. They do. They see the light in a situation. And they're choosing another option. 
and they're probably gonna this is a this is a big opportunity here it's like I'll give you whatever you want what do you want I'll do whatever it takes I'll give you what what do you want you, it, the choice is yours you know you can have it you can do whatever you can have it what do you want I'll do anything that's what I feel like this is I think we have somebody here that is uh Somebody might even get invited, invited out for drinks, invited out to a party, invited out to a restaurant, whatever, invited out dancing. There could be an invite that is coming. Somebody sees an option and it looks as though they're going to make their choice in the next cup. They're going to choose between two. They're definitely going to choose between two and they're going to make an, make an offer that, uh, it's almost like it can't be refused or they're going to make an offer that can't be refused, you know? They're going to make a really big offer that can't be refused. Something like that. I don't know. I feel like... Uh, we have a, a weak individual here that is, is very uh, scared. This person is scared of rejection. They are scared of rejection. They're scared of having to own up to the truth. They're scared of communicating, but I think you notice now the other one is gone. It's like they, they, they do communicate. There is going to be some communication from this person that is scared. The person that is scared of, of communicating is going to communicate. I think they're a little weary. They're a little weary. They may be intimidated, but they're going to do it. I think they're going to do it. They're going to make some sort of... Uh, well, they're going to communicate. They're going to communicate. It's almost like, they, it's like, uh, will you give me a chance? I don't know who this is, or can we try again, or start over, or something like that. That's what I feel like this is. We do have a new beginning here with that sun card. So we do have a new beginning. There is a new beginning here. There's a renewal or a reunion of some sort. A get-together. So, yeah, I think we have two people that are going to get together and, uh, you know, whoever these two people are, could have, if you aren't married to this person yet, you could certainly end up marrying them, okay? It could definitely lead to marriage. If you haven't met this person yet, you're going to meet this person at a party or, their, or a get-together, okay? Um, yeah, so, good luck. <laughs> 